Testing, testing, check one, two. I spent my entire paycheck on this. Spent my entire paycheck on this one, two, check. Wife is very mad. Check one, two, check. Welcome back to The Jerry Tanner Show, sponsored by the UGA Alumni Association. We did it, y'all. One and oh, we are undefeated. And we did not lose to Georgia State on the week two and the home opener. And who do we have as the dogs return to the hedges? Why, it is none other than Maury State. Bill Murray's face. Morris Day? Yes, of course. It's Murray State. Now you could be forgiven for not knowing much about Murray State, but I will tell you that you should know about Murray State, and I'll give you a few reasons why. One, their football program is 95 years old, which is only two years younger than the school itself. That is Southern Scholastic excellence. Two, numerous prominent coaches have called Murray, Kentucky home over the years. Frank Beamer, Bud Foster, Ralph Friesian, Justin Fuente, even the college football leprechaun himself, Houston Nutt. And three, their athletic director's name is Velvet Milkman. Have y'all heard about UGA Mentor Program? All right, so the idea is this. Alumni sign up to be mentors to current UGA students, and the mentees select a mentor that's the best fit for them. Maybe they have the same major. Maybe they want to work in the same field. Maybe they have a similar background something that could be a small commitment for alumni and make a huge difference for students. So if you're an alum, there is a student who wants to meet you. Mentor.uga.edu. Sign up today. Operators are standing by. No, they're not, but you know what I mean. All right, back to football. Murray State won their first game 59 to 20. Pretty good. Their opponent, however, was the University of Pikeville, whose claim to fame is the Kentucky College of Osteopathic Medicine. Now, as we all know, osteopathy is a medical field that advocates for um, strict avoidance of touchdowns. Let's not beat around the bush here. Georgia's 3-0 against FCS teams under Kirby Smart, and that's with a combined score of 113-38. to uh, Last year, we played another Ohio Valley Conference team, Austin P, and we beat them 45 to nothing. This year, Austin P was picked to finish ahead of Murray State, so... Now, I think we all know that preseason polls don't really amount to much. <coughs> Florida! But this one seems pretty safe. Call it 44 to 7, and let's just hope nobody gets hurt. Whew. Feeling a little parched after all that intense analysis. If y'all pardon me, I'm, I'm gonna take a little drink here, if you don't mind. <sighs> so satisfying. <laughs> Y'all be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell, and you'll never miss an episode. 